Yeah, we're good, though. All right, uh, what were you guys doing? You were driving up to... We, we just well, got kitted we just, out, and you we, were about to tell us how fucked we were. We're about to drive up. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so, yeah, you drive up to the, um... Up to the facility, uh, to get Laura a new robot, or a, just a robo, robo body, robot body. Um, yeah, so, you drive up to the front. There are two guards there, obviously. Unless you're going at, like, the guard shift change. Um... No, we're going when the, when the guards are there. Okay, yeah. So you go up to the thing. The guards are diff different. Guards look the same, obviously. Um, but they ask you, like, "What's your business here?" Uh, we're from. Uh, wait, what's the company we work Parian. for? Again? We're uh, Parian. we're from Parian. We're uh, we're some uh, you know. Uh... <laughs> Better be convincing. Yeah, fuck. Uh, okay, out of character. Wait, what's wait, the wait, word? Wait, wait. What's the word for like? Um, yeah, wait. We're, like not business partners, but uh, representatives. Wait, uh, I thought they didn't like Parian. That's what I said. No, so I we're know. gonna tell them we're from Parian. <laughs> well, here's the thing, Bulldog. Do you want what, me to get what, shot with a laser Bulldog, again? Bulldog, let me let me explain to you. Let me see if I can get a so, so, hold on. Sony, Sony and Microsoft are rivals. Okay. Yet Sony sold the Blu-ray to Microsoft to use in their Xbox One. Okay. That is the explanation. That's the same. Yeah. You get me? But Sony and Microsoft don't yes. have gang wars on the street. <laughs> neither do these guys. Yeah, neither. As far these, as we know. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> as far as I know. These as guys are... Let's put it like this. These guys are too small to be like a real threat to Parian. And they Parian's, still got a gun! Oh my god, and Parian's, I know what I'm doing. The Par Parian's far too large and has its own military branch to be now like... Had the fuck it. They, hold on, there was just be... a thing there was just a thing on the fucking news about Parian that was like, yo, we got a military, don't fuck with us. Yeah. Oh. So, I mean, they oh, they, yeah. they have stuff now, but yeah. By the way, Spencer, I'm not doubting that you can get us through this. I'm just saying. <laughs> he does, he well, doesn't Microsoft want to... doesn't shoot lasers at Sony. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, uh, yeah, so I'll be like, uh, yeah, we're Perian representatives don't working on a joint killed. project. Working on a joint project, and uh, so we, uh, they we got look... cleared to help. Yeah. So the guard looks at you. He has, like, a flashlight because it's dark. And he's yeah. like, papers, please. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna send him the papers that the doctor gave us. I mean, you could just Doesn't... hand it. They're old school. Yeah, like, yeah. Like I'm actual papers. So you hand him the Doesn't papers. Believe you at all? Shoot you. <laughs> they he looks at them, and then like walks over to the other security guard, and then like they radio in like, ah, oh, there's you know, whatever. They do it all calmly with like no emotion. Uh, but yes, hello. There yeah. are some people here with hey, Harry and some yeah. Shit's here. Yeah. So they come back to the car, and he's like, "You're cleared for for entry." Please try to, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, not, not to interfere with any of the yeah, just, you work know, that we are doing yeah, in, this don't, in this facility. Yeah, don't don't break anything, basically. If you need help. Do me a favor and fuck off. Go back. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> if you need help, please visit any of the help centers. But they, they allow you through, basically. You, yeah, you have clearance. Sense. They're just like, don't break anything. Don't. Oh, yeah, I'm going to drive around until, like, or, like, Drive to the robotics place. Don't, donuts in the parking lot. You're not going to drive to the parking lot? Just straight up to the robotics? Donuts. Well, I'm assuming there's <laughs> like different the parking yard. lots. There's yeah, different I parking mean, lots per area. Yeah, you drive to the robotics facility and like you get out. Everyone gets out of their vehicles. Um, you all have proper identification. So, or, you know, as proper as it's getting yeah. at this point. So fake proper identification. You walk up to the, uh, you walk up to the building. And there's some guards standing there. Can I do a like a secure like we we're basically we see the building like we're like in front of the building. Mm -hmm. Okay, I want to do a security check of the outside. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, just letting you know while I roll. Uh, what is security based off of intelligence? Yes. Actually, uh, looking at a lawyer again. Can I do a tactics roll of like how we're like response time and like stuff? Uh, like yeah, totally. Yeah, because I I don't want to use security. I'm gonna use tactics. The Intelligence. I don't know. Someone's sucking a dick. He's sitting in the kitchen. Kind of like. Uh, got a it's a sink. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, totally seven. Yeah, so, like, uh, it's more specific. I want to know like, do I see like, do I see people walking routes and stuff around the? Yeah, facility? totally. Okay. Totally. They're they're like. Uh, guard teams of like two or three yeah. uh, that pass through. There are also guards standing at the door. 
like I, I just want to know like how they're like how they're operating like if they're like two guards at the door and they're walking around doing no their... you you have two guards at the door mm -hmm. and then there's a separate team that like walks the grounds like they're okay there's probably like two teams for each facility that gotcha. walk the grounds each team is like between three and four people roughly okay. but yeah that's what you get out of the out of this basically okay cool so, um, can I also roll a security check just to be like, this will be the best best way to go in, or like? I mean, you have proper paperwork. That... You can just walk up and be like, "Hey, we're oh, supposed okay, to be yeah, here." Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. And they be like, All right, oh, then, yeah, okay. we're just gonna go fucking right on in. All right, so you walk up to place. the you walk up to the door and you can see like cameras like do zoom say, in on you. Do they say anything about the guns or? Uh, no, really. Okay. I mean, if you're here, you're supposed to be here, so they really, gotcha. you know, drone. Just, I, I always gotta ask. Like, it's yeah. Not like, yeah. So I mean, you walk up to them. In the facility, or you just walk up to the guards at the front. They ask to see your identification, and you show it to uh, them. Yeah. And they yeah, look, they look at each other, and then they just let you in. Mm -hmm. uh, so okay. as you you walk into the front building, it's very nice. Um, there's no like a fountain. Yeah, a koi well, pond. <laughs> not like a fountain or anything like that, but it's like white, very clean. Smells like uh, yeah. cleaner. Like cleaner. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, like lemon fresh. But the the building is like it's not big, but it's decent size. So there's like a couple different hallways that go everywhere. Uh, there's also like a stairwell that leads up, and then there's like a tube elevator that goes straight down. Okay, can it? Well, like I'm trying to think of it would be like what it would be tactics, perception, or security. Like I want to do the same thing I did outside, but inside. Yeah, Which one I mean be? we can use that same. Can I assist? If it's right, uh, yeah. it's up to Fro if he wants to use the same one or not. I yeah, just we can just use like, the okay. same skill check. But it's like okay, you do see guards in here. Mm -hmm. Um, there's like a guard desk, and there's a guy sitting at it. Um, and then you look down the hallways, and you can see like at least a team of like uh, down each hallway. You see a team of guards. Mm -hmm. Can I roll a check to be like um, this is the direction they'd have this at, or this is where this is? Or I mean, you pretty so. you pretty much know all that. Okay. Like just at a cursory glance, like. These guys aren't like, like it's one big facility. It's yeah, not like and they're office. and it's not like they're like independent thinking like guards. They're pretty autonomous as the way it looks. Okay. So they're just like doing whatever. Um, We're just kind of walking there, around. Is there anyone in here? Like besides yeah, there's, a, the guards? there's there's guards, but you don't see any like scientists or anything like that in here. Or real people. Yeah, you don't see anything like that. Like real, like actual people. Um, mm -hmm. There's a staircase that goes up, and there's like a tube that goes down. Uh, one of the, like, the guards sitting at the desk, like, motions you to come over. Uh, can I, like, elbow, uh, Seth and be like, can you use that, uh, that, that, that future ability? What future ability? Well, the ability that lets you see things. You, uh, hey, uh, you told me about that, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, I showed you, I was like, I was like, I, like, whispered to him, I'm like, I could do that, but that really only helps me. <laughs> well, you can tell, yeah, but you can tell us if they're gonna do anything bad, right? I'm like, sort of. I like. I mean, I get like, I get like a sense a, of yeah, like. You get a fifty-fifty on whether or not anything's actually gonna happen. Well, it's not like a fifty-fifty, but it's like if anything's gonna cause me, like I like, it depend. Like it's not just like physical. It could be like mentally or. Oh, I'm like, gonna be like, oh okay, and then I'm gonna walk. Like, I like, I like, and I like go yeah. like, I like. It could be like I get shot. It could be like I have a headache. <laughs> wow. Hurt okay. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna walk real over quick, the guard that Spencer, motions. Spencer, real quick, did you just open a soda? Uh -huh. Okay, just saying, we both opened the soda at the exact same time. Oh, wow. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. God, you guys are pro. Um, as soon as I opened, I heard a clank. I'm like, that, I have headphones on. I shouldn't have been able to hear that. <laughs> okay, so yeah, that's. I was wondering why. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah. That's crazy. So yeah, you walk up to the guard, and he goes, uh, he's like, can I help you? Um. Yeah, we were uh, looking for the... um. Tech Four Robotics Lab. Yeah. He, uh, he, <laughs> he looks at you like Tech Four, but no. Yeah. Um. He goes. Yeah, you know the robotics lab. I guess. He goes. It's down the. He goes. It's down that elevator. He's like, I can call it for you, and he like hits a button, <laughs> and like the elevator comes up with like a person in it. Yeah. And it's a woman. <laughs> in like a white dress or whatever, like a white business dress. I, 
I totally thought it's like you were gonna call up an elevator, and it's like it's the same guy in the elevator that's yeah. at the desk, and yeah. then he's like, "Jeff, these guys need to go to the robotics lab." Okay, Jeff, talk to you later, Jeff. <laughs> Bye, Jeff. No, they're not like <laughs> Gary from fucking Fallout. Oh, Gary. Right? Gary, Gary, Gary. Yeah. No, no, it's a woman. Uh, yeah. She goes what, right this way, and uh, if you guys all enter the elevator, she takes oh, you down. I'm getting, Just getting the elevator. Wringing her hands, yeah. Oh, well, I'm in the elevator. I slit her throat. <laughs> I mean, you can do that if you no, want. No, I'm gonna eat her face. <laughs> it's, a clear, it's a clear glass elevator. You just uh, cut uh. her throat. <laughs> yeah, just her face gets ate. I'm just like. <laughs> I mean, if you want to kill her, you can kill her. There's nothing. Uh, I slit stopping. her throat as the door opens. I slit the people outside the door. I slit their throat. <laughs> I go full Mr. Sicario. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I could decapitate her right here in the elevator. <laughs> If there's some way I can cover up all the blood that's gonna come out, <laughs> just let uh, me like put my hands on it or drink it, maybe. You know? before, <laughs> I'm a, I'm a vampire now. It. I need that. Before Bacon does it, he uh, just I just dropped a smoke uh. grenade. The entire thing fills with smoke as it's going down. <laughs> when, so, whenever no. we get to the bottom floor, <laughs> woman's completely gone. No trace. No no <laughs> sign of the trouble. Just us. Just, you pull the smoke grenade as you, like as you pull it and drop. You're like 420 blaze it back it. Yep. <laughs> all you see, all you see then, from that scene would be like a glass, would elevator. be like a circular glass elevator yeah. with filled with smoke, and then you see like blood hit the side <laughs> of the glass, and then it's it just filled yeah. with smoke. Yeah. Um, Whoa, that was weird. Yeah, <laughs> that no, was no, man. Bacon, bacon throw, weird. throw back to my horrible struggle in the back oh of the box God. car. You see a revolver <laughs> shot come through. Damn it! <laughs> goes straight through. Completely misses everyone. Got it. Okay. Oh my God. So yeah, you guys go down. It takes you down like. Four or five different like floors. Forty leagues. Uh, you're definitely like underneath the facility now, and you get to the bottom of the facility, like oh, the bottom floor. That, that reminded me, bro. When I looked up the stuff about like the Tech Four like robots and stuff, what did I find out? Like when I was just like looking to see like what they were capable of. Uh, I mean, depending on the thing, they can hold a gun. Like like they... like generic like generic like Tech Four like. Generic Tech Four robots are, they're not human, but they can do most things humans can. So they yeah. can fly ship, they can shoot people, they can Shit. pick stuff up, you know, all normal yeah. stuff. They can talk to like, you, that type of stuff. Like, Tech 5 is just that, like... Tech that 5 looks blend. like a human. No, I would say, tech, like, the difference between Tech 4 and Tech 5 is, like, Tech 5 is that blend of, like, this could probably be a human. Yeah, basically. Yeah. It's like, uh, it could be human, but yeah. maybe robot. Yeah. Okay. Um, but, yeah, you get down there, and... You get to the robotics facility, and down here there are actual scientists. There's also like a few guards, but they're yeah. actual scientists. The scientists don't look like the guards. Yeah. Um, giant, and... giant mecha, fucking like the things from RoboCop. Like, yeah. I yeah. And you get down there, and the doors open, and she says, she like motions to you guys to leave the elevator. Yeah. Um, right. you guys, I guess you all leave the elevator. The doors close, and it goes back up to the top. Um, mm -hmm. and one of the, there's a sign, there's a lady in a lab coat. She's like writing something down. She walks up to you. She's like, excuse me, excuse me. Are you, uh, can I help you? Uh, uh but why are you here? Um, we I were told by Perion that, uh, <laughs> you'll needed our assistance with stuff, with something. So, um, she's we're like, here. um, she's like, hold on. I, I, I don't know. I have to speak to the head scientist. And she like, uh, she like leaves. I'm going to, uh, she's like, just stay I'm right like, here. And then she motions for like, I'm going to message doc. I'm gonna message Shoots the doctor. Her in the back, just bam. Start right, I'm gonna message the doctor. doctor. <laughs> Shit gets kicked off. All right, I'm gonna message the doctor and be like, "Can you uh, make up like a fake report that we're gonna that we need a robot for something?" And, and like, man, I message that. Uh, yeah, you no. send you send it out, and the doc gets back to you. Goes, I'm, I mean, you'd have to hack into their systems <laughs> to to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna an inbound report. I message him fast and be like. Try it right now, fast. Like, <laughs> I mean, he could try, but you're not. Nah. Gonna, he's not gonna be able to get okay. it. Okay. Does the doctor? I'm, does the doctor know I'm good with computers? No, probably not. Probably not. Okay. I mean, oh, he's all right with the computer. You, you make computer roll. Well, I just mean like, if he, like, I'm, like, because like the I remember from like Swan Song where like Piano was uh, like in the other room was like I could help you because she's know she's always listening in on stuff. Yeah. Kind of Ten. Thing, all right, so. Doc, like, makes up some bullshit parrying, like, oh, they're yeah. supposed to be here, they yeah. come to look at your newest and highest, uh, uh, was it, like, test model robot, whatever. Perfect. For buying, and he sends that off, and the science head comes back, like, the head dude, and he introduces himself as Dr., uh, like, uh, what would his name be? Let's see if I can find an NPC name that's good. <coughs> some of these NPC names are pretty good. 
dude. All right, his Dalton. name is Nicholas Darwin. His name is uh, Doctor Blossengum. Blossengum. Yeah, he walks up to uh, he walks up to Key because Key, you look like a uh, scientist. So he walks up. He says, "Hello, I am Doctor Wilhelm uh, Wilhelm Blossengum, uh, head uh, scientist here in the robotics facility. Uh, how can I help you?" Um. Well, we're uh, from Piran, and we were told uh, that we could uh, we were going to come and look at your uh, newest robot, so that we could maybe make adjustments to it, and you know, help you out on it. He's like, oh, 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 yes, yes. I, I got a uh, I got a uh, message from Brass about that. Yes, yes. Uh, come, follow me this way. So as you're Perfect. walking, um, you can see uh, like you walk down a hallway. There are a bunch of scientists. It's very busy in here. Um, but on your like your one side is like a glass wall, so you can see like, and they're making like. Yeah, they're making like uh, robots, but they're not like, like they're like security bots, like yeah. faceless, yeah, like turrets, gray, turrets on normal. Fucking their hands. No, like they they're curved people and they hold guns and stuff like that. But it's like very like basic, nothing fancy. Um, like it doesn't have like a screen on the face or anything. It's just the gray. Yeah. Like nothing. Like face. like the blank robots from Futurama before they download Lucy Liu. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And uh, okay, perfect. And that's on one side, and on the other side, they're making, like, uh, energy weapons on the other side. So, like, assembling uh, laser rifles and shit like that on the other side. And you keep going, and you walk into, uh, like, you go by a bunch of, like, conference rooms. You keep going, uh, and he, he, he motions you into this uh, department. You guys walk in through the door and close the door. And he's like, this is our newest model. We're... We're almost finished bridging the gap, and he's like talking to you. He's also talking to uh, Tony, who's dressed up as a Parian executive. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And Tony's got like his hair in like a ponytail. He's trimmed yeah. his beard down, um, so he looks like actually nice. Yeah. And uh, he looks like he fits the suit perfectly. Um, oh, yeah. Then I'm. I, yeah. Okay. And he's he's like, yeah, I see, I see. I mean, you know, uh, I heard for the longest time you were on the cutting edge of uh, robotics. And he's like, oh, for, for a time, yes, but uh, you guys far outclassed us at, at a certain point. He's like, uh, come, 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 come look at our new uh, our new bo uh, robot. So he gets to the robot, and they, uh, it's in a like a case almost. Yeah. And he leads you into the room, and there's a couple other scientists in there, and they're like looking at computers and stuff. And you look at the robot, and it's got like a human face, like with skin, yeah. but the rest of the robot body is like clear. Or like it has like a like a white plastic. Yeah, like oh, like um, it's see throughable, but it's blurry. You get me? Is that what you're talking yeah, about? Yeah. Okay. But the face is like human, like plexiglass. That's yeah, it's, it's like uh, it's like I got a plexiglass body, but yeah. it's a robot inside. But then it's yeah. got a like a human face. Uh, male or female? It's a female, definitely. Okay. He's like, this is our bridge, uh, robot. Uh, I... it, he's like it is in between the halfway point. It's in between uh, stage four and five robotics. So uh, walk... this one <laughs> is walk up to it the and... newest thing we got. Oh yeah, yeah, you're totally talking. Walk. Yeah, and I'm like looking at it like intensely. What does it look like? Um, specifically, obviously the face. The rest is kind of I can imagine. Did you ever see that fucking movie? Oh, what was that <clears throat> movie called with that Ex Machina? Machina? Is that the movie? Ex Machina, the newer one that came out. Yeah. The way that robot looks in that, yeah, like I that. Guess. I can look it up. Ex Machina. Perfect. Ex... I don't. I haven't seen it. I just seen the commercials. So because like Ex Machina is like that horror movie sort of that like yeah. Weird, it's called like... Ex oh, okay. Is it called? Yeah, that? yeah, 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 yeah. I okay. know what you're talking about. So it has the face, but the rest is like the the face is human, but the rest is like robotic. I yeah, 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 totally. Yeah, and he's like, this is our newest model. He's like, this is the cutting edge of robotics the bridge between the half and half he was like uh he was like we we haven't yet mastered tech or, or you know like tech real five. tech yeah. five robots which are humans basically and he's yeah, like well, creating uh, a skin and bone human is uh quite difficult but i think we're getting pretty close well uh will it run can you, do you have you gotten into run yet he says we don't have an we don't have a operating system for it yet uh i say like do you would you use uh I say, would you use VI or AI on it? He, he like, ponders that question. Like, he's yeah. been asked that a few times before, yeah. and he doesn't have the answer yet. But he's like, we don't know yet. He says, putting an AI into such a thing would probably be for the best. He says, because uh, VI cannot learn. It cannot adapt. Um, 
but then again, AI can sometimes be pretty unstable. So like, uh, right now, I'm like up against like the glass of whatever case it's in. I like it. staring at it. Yeah, staring at it. Okay. So Tony, we know uh, uh, we have a facility on um. Shit, what's that planet called? Can you go? Uh, what's the planet that we just came from? Uh, the planet you came from was uh, it is. I don't know the names. It's in the Salaja system. It's by Cora, but the closest system that has like a real Parian research is Lazardus. The Lazardus okay. system. So yeah, I'm like, uh, well, yeah, we have right. a facility in Lazardus that we can uh, help uh, help further it if uh, you let us uh, take it for a little bit. Can I roll a persuade? Because that was not a good reason. So he thinks about it for a moment. Yeah, you can roll a persuade and be like, "Hey, Oof. we should totally take this robot, and we can help you out." All right. Yeah. I mean. You're like, like, uh, we could help further this research with so this stuff, so and so, you know. Um, mm -hmm. You're and I'll be like, yeah. um, yeah, and I'll be like, you know, um, up at Brass can figure out the contracts, but we can uh, take this thing off your hands. <laughs> and up at Brad, he, he looks at yeah. uh, at Tony basically because Tony's dressed as his executive. He says, yeah, "What do you think like, about this?" And Tony look lo just like like thinks for a moment and goes, "Well." I know that Ranavag we got at uh, that there facility definitely could uh, take a look at this thing for you, have it up and running, tip-top shape, you know, maybe figure out some of the bugs. But uh, you'd have to give it to us now so we could get it there right can I, quick. Can I? Can I? Uh, Damn, son! On it right now, I like see like. Uh, Wait, what do you want to do? I want to do a computer's check. Yeah, go ahead. Like oh, on Real it. Quick. Yeah. Would these guys get me fucking killed? Can I like scan the room? Yeah, go ahead. Like, Make a tactics yeah. roll and be like, all right, this is the best way or, to kill everyone in so, this room. So you could it, like you could do security tactics or per uh, perception, whichever right. one like better. Like, so all right, so tactics and then no, either one. What do I, what do yeah. I use? Tactics, for, intelligence. Uh, intelligence. Yeah. All right. Uh. Nine. All right. So Vlad looks. Vlad. Like for, maybe you like, go into uh, like uh, the Borderlands. Uh, was it the game? What's the uh, the board the Telltale Borderlands game? Uh -huh. uh, maybe you go into that where like the girl can see like what she's gonna do. So um, you see like you see like uh, Vlad like pointing and you see like Seth like slitting someone's throat and like <laughs> Tony shooting someone and then you see like another one like off to the right you can see like you guys running out the door after like taking the doctor hostage or whatever oh the oh the cut screen through yeah, yeah like okay. like oh you could do this or this so yeah. that's what Vlad gets like and oh, then it kind of like well, narrows yeah. narrows eyes it's like i could shoot the, i could shoot that hydrogen tank over there and yeah. kill everyone in this room like exactly uh, like you all you, die you know how to, to kill either us all escape right now. or yeah. kill everyone in this room so I wanted to ask, bro, is there, like, a computer hooked up to it? Yeah, there's, like, a computer that someone's typing on. That someone's typing on? Yeah. Pit -pat, pit -pat. Like, someone's typing on, like, right next to it? No, it's thing? not. There's no computer that's, like, hooked to it. The computer's across yeah. the room, like, on a desk. And there's a person, like, typing on it. Typing on it? Mm -hmm. Uh, Is there any way I can, like, look Swag at, like, the walk. specs of, like, this robot? Like, Swag a walk Yeah, I mean, you can hey, honestly, you could honestly just ask them, and they'd be like, oh, yeah, here we go. Uh, because, like, so maybe maybe I, Tony I, I know, says here's it. The thing, I don't know how to. I don't know like how to. So so on. maybe Tony says it then because he is an executive. So maybe do you like whisper to Tony or something? Uh, wait one second. Okay. He swagger walks over. Hey nerd. Yeah. See? Yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, if you get this body, I mean, you're. I mean, it's pretty high tech level body. So. And if it uh, doesn't work, I was gonna say like I want because like I don't on. know how I would like ask anything because I wanted to figure out like yeah I mean if it could fit Laura inside yeah you could you ask know? you could be like hey Tony could this do this well that's why I was just I gonna mean, like he could totally ask I mean well I don't know like do I know the exact specifications of like yeah but you looked it up yeah, yeah you looked it up and you or, both you and I know it. well I I you looked it up I asked general oh. I asked general information about like yeah Tony. key would know but you would be like you should I mean you could ask uh, Tony yeah. and then Tony could ask key I like I guess like man but ah damn it so I guess I'll roll it, it would look oh, it I would look like, pretty menacing for you to like whisper to the executive and the executive whisper to the scientist and be like does it uh does it do this yeah. you know well, I, uh, I guess I asked, like, is there any way we could see, like, the specs of the, the thing, like, on the computer, and I, like, motion to, like, the person at the computer kind of thing. 
Uh, are you asking the main like, doctor? Like, like, like Dad is the word. Doctor, like yeah, uh, the, the, the doctor. Okay, yeah. He's like, yes, of course, of course, for for our Parian clientele, of course. So, he walks over to the monitor. Instead of using the monitor, he hits a button on this clear glass table, and yeah. it pops up, a, like, a hollow monitor, so you can see yeah, through hollow. on each side. Okay. And he was like, here are the specifications, and judging by the specifications on the thing it's you know it's made of like a titanium alloy like some of the yeah. best like components that you can get top of the line shit yeah. should but i roll like computer memory... to understand this that's why i i guess oh, yeah. you could use my computer's roll then yeah i mean uh, you like... pass the you guys pass the computer okay. roll. she understands what's happening so but memory wise i it wouldn't be enough to hold an ai like the body wouldn't be able enough to hold okay. an ai there's almost no robot that can yeah. hold a full ai yeah, um, but it could control it. But you, but you can tether the AI to that, and it's not like that. It would, it would sync basically, like same way you like, sync yeah. your phone like an to iPhone computer. to a computer. Yeah. yeah, and it would be able it would to like use hook it. in and, and just use it as like. Yeah, it would be not that it would yeah. be separate. It would be an extension of that AI. Yeah. So uh, what I asked, like, what what does it run on? Kind of thing, like. She's like he's he's like it's completely. Um, He's like, you would need uh, some sort of a charging uh, bay, but uh, if we figure out the charging the battery problem with it, we could probably get it to run indefinitely. We've of course hit some uh, some uh, some problems, some roadblocks, if you will, in the way. Like we said, uh, we have we have Kirion can help figure that out. <laughs> so you keep like saying you, like we have the best scientists, we can figure this out. Yeah, like. Uh, yeah, I mean, you need a docking station, but you could easily create, like, a docking station or have, like... Well, we need the money for it and all that shit, but, like, you hear I me, mean, like... I sure, you guys like, got paid 60000 Yeah. Uh, But, yeah, I was about to say, I mutter, like, under my breath, it's like, Laura will love it kind of thing. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah so he's, like... He looks at Tony and says, so, uh, uh, how are we going to work this out? I mean, we can't just, uh, give it to you, obviously, you know, procedure and stuff and such. Um, he said, give so, this, bam! Yeah, so he's, like, so he's, like, it off he's like, so, like, so, you know, you Spike can't, like, face. you can't, like, take it. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. like, you have to work on it here, basically, is as, his thing. Yeah. As, yeah. He, as he says that, like, I want to, like, say, it's like, do you mind if I look around the facility? And like, like this room, or you mean like the entire? Like the other, like the other robotic, like, like stuff. He's like, like I, yeah, yeah, he's like, but take one of these guys uh, with you, and he just he motions to Tony or Vlad, either yeah. one of the two. Uh, mm. I take Tony, obviously. Okay, <laughs> so Tony, so Tony, so he's like, he's like, yes, you take the executive. You guys, uh, I will sign you, a, a doctor. And he points to a woman. He's like, doctor. If... Uh, uh, Mira here, Mr. and and she'll Mr. she'll give you a tour of the facility. Mm -hmm. Tony's okay, like, All so right. like, uh, and like how many how many bad not bad guys how many guards are in this room? There are no uh, guards in this room. It's only scientists. So it's just me and the scientist. Me, it's who you, else? It's you. So a head here's scientist, the scientist, you, Vlad, and then like two like assistant scientists that are like working. I was about to say Spencer, draw a picture. We walk. There's guards outside, and patrols outside. We walked inside. There were guards inside. We went down in an elevator. There were guards and real actual people. Yeah. Like scientists were. Yeah, no, I know that. And then he took us into like the back area of the room okay. past manufacturing into another room where it was like, this is our. Okay, yeah, this is the so like, jewel. and we're deep underground, right? Yeah. We're, yeah. You'd have to take the elevator back up. Okay. Hmm. So where, where does she take us, bro? So you guys walk out, and she takes you back down that hallway, and she yeah. she's like, this is the main corridor over here. We make. Uh, tier one uh robotics and they're very simple on the you know on the right we make uh laser rifles they keep she keeps going down the thing like here are t tier three uh robots here are tier two yeah. robots that type of shit um, um you I also wanna, see like, that there's like a tram system i was say yeah, i want to make a perception i want to make a perception roll as in like is there any other like exits like emergency like elevator or stairway out of like the yeah, room yeah you can like, make that perception. in case like i don't know Collapsing, yeah, kills everyone. Oh no, there's a mur there's a murder. Quick, we have to save the robot. <laughs> now, would this one be on intelligence or would it be on wisdom? Because I'm looking. Uh, around. I got wisdom. A wisdom, okay. Mm -hmm. Wisdom. Uh, am I assisted? No. Uh, no. Well, I, I didn't tell Tony. Yeah. Yeah, so. you didn't tell Tony. Fine. Yeah. All, All right, fine. so 
Yeah, because it's obviously labeled, like, because there are um, real people down here. It's like, <laughs> like, hey, this is a fire exit. Hey, this is an exit. Hey, this is an exit. There are, most of them are, like, stairs, though. Yeah. They're not, like, uh, an elevator. Okay. Um, you also know that there's a tram system that links all the buildings together. Okay. Like, the, and there's also, the tram also goes to the spaceport as well. So it links, there's an underground tunnel system that links everything. Gotcha. Um, so, yeah. So maybe as you guys are walking around, Tony's like, man, this is a pretty suave place you got here. And he's, like, looking around and shit. And as he says that, we cut back to Key, who's talking with the doctor. Um, yeah. So you I'm get, like, a side wipe. To persuade him. Yeah. And we get to the room, and he's like, so, uh, doctor, uh, I didn't catch your name. And he puts his hand out. Um, shit, can I, can I roll a persuade to bullshit a Hugh, name, and you come up with uh, one? Hugh, I got a Hugh name for man. you. Hugh Doctor Man. Hugh Man, sir. <laughs> yeah, what, 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 Devin? Dr. Man. M A N N. Hold on, yeah. I'll, I'll come. I'll get a name for you. Just, just. I mean, I have a list of NPC names, but. No, oh, no, I, got, I could always I got make names. up a name for you. Dude. Masashi Kishimoto. I honestly want him to use Human because I sound, that sounds uh, hilarious. No, uh, uh, I did, Pipe dude, Kubo. Can I? Can I? Can I yeah. Pipe Kubo? yeah. Oh, okay. That's the guy from Bleach. <laughs> He's the guy who wrote it. Spencer oh yeah, Hughes. give me a name. Spencer oh, I, you were okay. Yeah, Bacon, give him a name. I was about to say. I was about to say like like. De uh, Dexter, uh, what was Jack. Yeah, Jack, Jack Inhofe. Inhofe. <laughs> My name's Jack. Jack Inhofe. My name's Doctor Inhofe. Jack. No, Inhofe. not that Doctor. I said Dexter. Dexter. Oh yeah. yeah. Uh, oh man. Uh, that's funny. Dexter. <laughs> I can't stop thinking of like Jack, Jack off, sir. Jack, <laughs> Jack, 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 off, Jack off. Doctor uh, off. Doctor, doctor in off. Neil. Uh, <laughs> Neil and blow me. Neil and blow me. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one too. But, uh, Dexter McCrum or something. Dexter. Yeah. Okay. Fuck yeah. Dexter McCrum. Yes. So you're Doctor yes. McCrum. I'm Doctor McCrum. All right. So nope. Nope. Shake hand, hand Doctor McCrum. Yeah. He shakes your hand. Doctor McCrum. Um, he's like, so uh, how how are we going to do this? Obviously, I mean, your exec will work out the finer details, but we can't just give this to you. I mean, you'd have to work here. Of course. Uh, well, give us some time to like analyze it. You know, make a few phone calls, and uh, we'll, we'll we'll get it on from there. You know, like, yeah. We'll, we'll we'll make it. So we'll start moving it along. He's like, oh, but of course. He said, but uh, until then, you can we can open this case if you want, and you can have a look at her. And um, of course, you're free. Feel free to check over the uh, schematics and stuff like that. If you have any questions, my assistants will be here to help you. Um, okay. If you need me, just ask them, and they will get a hold of me. And well, like, uh, I'm, like I'm gonna wait you. for the uh, the higher exec to uh, make so, any of the big decisions. So yeah. So he thanks you and he shakes your hand. Perfect. I'll shake. And uh, and he leaves. So. Perfect. So it's just you and Vlad in this room. And the two assistants. Yeah, and two like science assistants. Okay. Yeah. Are they real people, Fro? Yeah. Are they are they like interns? Yeah, basically. I mean. Uh, okay. They're like they're they from like, they're from they're the, like twenty. They're from a nearby uh, university. Is there like a role to make to make it so it looks like I know what I'm doing? I mean, you, like, can walk start, like, you can just start fucking around with shit. You can start pretend. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna walk around. And, I mean, like, you could open, and look at you things can ask them and like open the case, and you can look, look at over them. look over what they're doing and just be like, hmm, I see. You know, like just walk around and like examine things. Yeah. Just like be thinking of plans to like get out of here. Yeah, totally. Yeah. So uh, we cut back to Seth and to and Tony. Uh, Seth, what are you doing? You're just walking around like I'm. I'm walking around, but like can't. Uh, guess I roll a stealth. Because I want to, like, whisper to Tony. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I mean, you can do that. I can just do that? Okay. It's pretty loud. So, yeah. I mean, she probably won't notice. Uh, yeah, okay. So, I, I whisper to Tony. I was like, I was like, I think, I was like, I think Laura will really like it. But <laughs> I really don't see a way to get it out of here. Tony's like, well, hey, thanks for a moment. He's like, we could always start a fire. <laughs> like, and just drag it out. I want to do a tactics roll of, like, what that would do. Like how people would react to like, there's a fire. <laughs> um. Yeah. Or I mean, what, what, what would it be? What would the role be? I mean, tell me. It would be tactics. It'd be. I think it would be more security. Like, security? what would they do okay. to? So what I'll would happen security. when they would be like, oh, yeah. fire alarm's been pulled? Like, what would happen? Yeah. So, uh, intelligence assisted. No. What would I think? What would happen? Like. All right. So you're like, well, in a standard like fire drill, yeah. people leave the building. Yeah. So most people would probably leave the building, um, <laughs> but other than that, you don't know what yeah. would happen. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, 
Tony's like, Tony whispers back, like, I don't know, maybe we could blow some shit up. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it can't be that hard to get everybody out of this building. <laughs> I was like, is it, well, we don't know if it, I'm like, we don't know if it moves. How heavy is it? Uh, I'm like Tony's thinking, like, like, all these questions. Tony's like, yeah, we can get a dolly or something, get a lift. We can, <laughs> yeah. we can get her out here, no problem. <laughs> He's like, not yeah. sweating it at all. Yeah. Doesn't give a fuck. He's like, yeah, we can get her out of here. I've, I've done worse. Yeah, like <laughs> figure it out. Yeah, like so. I I don't know. Like I'm thinking, I'm thinking of like a plan to like get it out. Or so he taps the lady on the shoulder. He's like, "All right, thanks for the tour, but uh, let's head on back to that room now." <laughs> She's like, "Yeah, of course, of course." And she uh, like she takes yeah. you guys back to the room, and uh, she is like, "If you need any help, uh, you can ask me. I'll be outside at the desk." And there is, there's like a desk outside the door. Yeah, perfect. Um, okay, so when they get in, I'm gonna like look at the uh, the interns and like be like, uh, "Can we get some privacy to discuss some things?" And ask if they'll leave. Uh, I mean, I'm they're like, persuade. they're like, well, like, I mean, we can't really leave this room. So you yeah. persuade them. So they're like, "All right, we're gonna leave this room, but we're gonna put a guard in here." Yeah. To, okay. To make sure you don't take anything. So they leave, yeah. and like a guard comes yeah. in. You know, no emotion. Yeah. Just like. Gary, 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 <laughs> Gary looking guy. Um, I just want to be like, so, uh, how's this deal gonna go? Uh, and I'm gonna look at Tony. <laughs> Tony's like, well, and he like, you can see him like, he has his knife so, up his sleeve. So, and you can start to see the hilt come out. <laughs> as like, like he's doing this, like, I walk, like, I walk, like, out the door. Like, where was the tram system? Where was that? Uh, you'd have to go, like, out the door, down the hallway a little ways. And then there's like uh like some stairs that go down to a tram system. Okay. What I want to do is like I want to go like is there a bathroom kind of thing in this room? Not in this room, but, but like, yeah, you have I to go ask, out the like, door. I want to ask. Yeah, I want to ask for like where's the bathroom? All right. Yeah. So uh, you open the door. The guy doesn't stop you from leaving. He's just there yeah. to make sure you don't steal anything. Yeah. Um, you go out the door. You ask him, and they they yeah. show you to the bathroom. Okay. Cherry bomb the toilet. So I, when I go into like the bathroom stall, I want to like, what's what's in the bathroom? What does it look like? Very clean. Uh, there's no one in here at the moment. Okay. Uh, but like you know, normal hide. normal future bathroom, like dead space bathrooms, but with all yeah, the, three, without all the blood and gore. Three yeah. So I want to I want to like stealth away. Like I want to like get away without anyone noticing me. Like, yeah, I mean, go ahead and make a stealth check. I'll add. Make a like a plus. I'll give you a plus one because it's like there's yeah. a lot of people in here, so you can probably just like whoop. I'm gone. Stealth dexterity. Assistant. Um. Well, while they're doing that, oh, I, well, um, plus one sorry. nine. I didn't add the one. Nine. All right. Cool. Yeah. You can slip away into the crowd. Yeah. No one will know you're missing. I mean, it's not like they're keeping tabs on you. Yeah. But like, I wanted to like walk off, and I guess like I'm gonna find like a tram system or like wherever that was. Like, I just want to yeah. like disappear off somewhere. All right, yeah. You okay. Find the tram system, um, but yeah. When when, uh, so, when she does that, so what we uh, see conference. is we see Seth walk off into the crowd of like lab coated scientists and <laughs> disappear, and then we like we we wipe downwards and uh, we're back in the room. Okay, and I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, gesture to the gar gesture to the cigar to the guard and be like, uh, can you bring in one of those assistants? We need to take a look at the robot. So yeah, uh, the guard like opens the door and asks one of them. And one of the assistants come in. He types on the computer, and the uh, the case is like standing up, mm -hmm. and it like slides down and like lays down, and then it mm -hmm. like it slides open. Ooh, pants. Ooh, and uh, and the body's in there. Yeah. Perfect. I'm gonna like kind of like examine it and like like think of a weight, how much it weighs, or you know like. I mean, you could ask. Like him. pick it up a bit. Oh yeah, yeah, and be like, so uh, how much does this thing weigh? So he looks at it. He he shows you the weight. It's like. I don't know, like two metric tons. No, it's not like super heavy. Uh, I would say it's like two hundred and something pounds. Okay. Maybe, maybe like so. Uh, how heavier. do you? Uh, how uh, is that light? Like, no. think about that and be like, is that no? Like for what they're doing? For oh. for robot weight, that's probably heavier than most robots. But okay. she is lighter than like a Tech Four like commando <laughs> droid. Basically. Yeah, so so I'm be like, like, so what makes it so heavy? Or you know, like what's uh what's with what the weight? Makes it so light is what yeah, it yeah. Be. yeah. Well, what makes it so light? He's like, Well it's using the lightest carbon fiber like parts. It's also using like like the newest like titanium carbon alloys that they can create. So it's actually a lighter 
than the specs mm-hmm. say because the specs are to like a uh, like that yeah. it's like that size of something. So this thing's probably more around the lines of like 190 pounds or something like that. Yeah, like yeah. like a like a. Grown it's like man. it's like a person. It's a grown person. Yeah. yeah. So no, uh, I'm gonna like be like. So like, you can't activate it at all, right? Like it's, it's like it doesn't have a operating drive. We can turn it on and the eyes will open, but you can't ask it any questions or anything like that. Nothing will. Okay. It won't answer you. Okay. But like. While we're, I guess like while this is happening, Fro, like while he's asking the questions, mm-hmm. what is like by the tram? Is it just like for transit? Yeah, it's a tram system, so it's kind of like a subway. Yeah. Okay. So there's so like there's a, there's there's a platform, science. and there's like trains. There's scientists down here, and there's like mm-hmm. you know, that type of stuff. Like in the huge. Uh, I want to like message like, Laura and the doctor. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You can do that. I I say, well, like, I'm excited, like, now. I'm like, we found it, kind of thing. Okay. Doctor sends a smiley face back. Yeah. But I say, like, but we have no way of getting it out. <laughs> mm, so the doc is like, the doc's like, well, I mean... I say, uh, I also say it doesn't have an operating system. So the doc comes back and he's like, well, it's good it doesn't have an operating system. It'll make the transition easier. Um, he's like, but secondly, he's like, getting it out, he's like, I don't know what to tell you. He's like, I'm not there with you, so I can't. Is there, like, any, uh, I don't know, like, dollies or anything like that would be used for, Transporting like, carrying heavy, heavy yeah, objects? Yeah, they're, they're yeah. everywhere. I mean, everywhere. you can just find one. Ah, uh, fuck me. I don't know. You could find, That's a, a, you could find yeah. a grab dolly, yeah, no problem. I'm thinking of a plan, but I'll be back. You guys do whatever. All right. Okay. <laughs> so you have she's getting this conversation on the on the thing, and then we we come back to you guys. Um, that are standing in there. Yeah, you can you can like touch her if you want and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. Can I text um the doctor and be like, uh, get the ship ready? <laughs> yeah. The, the doc uh, just sends a like a KK like message back. Like, yep. Yeah. I'm, I'm like, on my way. Starting her up. Um. Then I guess when Seth gets back, be like. Just, can you bring something to carry her? We're just gonna bust out of here, you know, like... Okay, we're just gonna kill everyone in the room and... Yeah, be like, yeah time I to knew go. it was gonna fall down to that. <laughs> it always comes down to just shooting everybody in the room. So, yeah. Yeah, I mean, when Seth comes back, you can tell her. Perfect, yeah. Okay, but uh, so Doc's like, yeah, that. so do you tell Doc, like, land at the... Yeah, land at the spaceport. Okay, so Doc's like, all right, I'm going to have to get some permission through Parian, but yeah, we can totally do this. Okay, perfect. And Doc, all right, yeah. Doc makes up some shitty bullshit. Like, all right, yeah, I'm supposed to be here picking up the crew. You know, we're not, we'll, and we'll just drive the car into the ship, and then we'll take off. It'll be fine. Yeah. So, um, yeah, all right. I guess I'll wait for, for, for stuff to get so back. So Tony's, cause... like, looking around the room, and there's just, like, the assistant and a guard in here. Can I also roll tactics? Yeah, you can. So t- while you're doing that, Tony walks up to the to the body, and he like pokes her face, and he looks at he looks at Key. He's like, "Yo, Key, come over here. Look, come poke her face real quick." Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go poke her face. So you walk up and you poke her face. It feels like a human face. Like, oh wow, it's it's human like. God, that's that's bizarre. And he's like, "Check this shit out. Isn't this fancy?" And he's like poking her face. <laughs> yeah. And he's like looking at her. Like? He's like. He's like, man, we I can't wait to have a personal murder bot. Yeah. I've been wanting them some things for so long. Look at this thing. This is this is the highest quality murder bot I've ever seen. Yeah, put put a chainsaw on the hand and you Yeah, and he's like covertly like whispering this to you because he's not yeah, yeah. out like, yeah, we got a fucking murder robot. <laughs> like Um Is is thirteen a strong a strong at all? Can you give me a a measurement uh, of how much I could carry? I think if you or go like to your an amount. Ca- if you go to your character sheet, it actually tells you how much you can carry. Uh, is, where is that? Uh, go to. Let me look here. Oh no, this one doesn't have it. Yeah. I'm thinking of fifth, the fifth edition ones has it. Uh, I think it's a six, and he doesn't have a constitution. Uh, five, I guess, because it's plus your con modifier. All right, so um. I don't know. How? What's your strength? Thirteen. Mm, I don't know that you can carry 
Maybe okay. if you and Tony both carry him, because it's like carrying a person. So you and Tony could probably yeah. carry this thing. But at the same right. time, it's like you got to fend off security while you're Yeah, well, I use one-handed. Thing. Well, is the spike thrower one-handed? What I know? Hell no. No, oh, no. I mean, you can, you it, can it see can it's be. not one-handed. Like, he can, Tony could just shoot it, like... Okay, well, but... I'm going to be like, uh, Tony, would you able... Would, uh, I'm going to, I guess, whisper to him as well. Should I roll stealth for that, or...? I mean, no. The the, the okay. assistant's left the room as just a security guard, and he's not going to... Okay. Well, I'm going to be like, uh, can Tony, we can... Uh, okay, yeah, I'm going to work whisper for Tony and be like, you think you can carry it and shoot some people at the same time? <laughs> Tony, Tony looks at you and goes, well, I might have to put her down, but... Ah, uh, well, I have, uh, I have my revolver if you need to use that, like... He was like, that thing's a pansy weapon. Sure, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. So, like, should, can I roll stealth to, like, pass it to him? Yes. That you would have to roll stealth. Because then they'd be like, oh, he's giving him a gun. Like, like, oh, shit, things are going down. Okay. Nice. Yeah, so you hand that gun off to Tony, and he's like, all right. And he, like, tucks okay. that shit into his suit. All right, and then I'm going to wait for uh, for a message back from Seth. Okay. Or till she gets here. I'm going to be like, bring bring something to carry, or, like, bring something to carry this, and then we break through and, like... Cool, so, maybe we, before we cut out for our last break, you we see you handing, like, discreetly handing the gun to Tony, Tony, like, puts it in his, like, jacket pocket, like, in his inner suit pocket, and he's like, alright, ready when you are, and we cut to a commercial. Okay, perfect. <laughs>